Hi, welcome to this demo on SAP Sugar CRM integration. As you can see here, the sales area in uh, SAP have been mapped into Sugar CRM. Also, a sales hierarchy module has been created to map the hierarchy levels of your sales team. When you have your sales team organized in Sugar CRM, you can assign the sales area and the hierarchy level so that the data which they access is controlled by this combination. You can see here that the customer master and the material master are already synchronized with SAP. So here you can see the customers and the material. Any changes to the customer master or material master in SAP would automatically reflect in CRM as well. This forms the base for the sales and distribution cycle in uh, CRM. In Sugar CRM, you have quotation, contracts, and orders which can be created into SAP. Outbound delivery and invoices are created in SAP and they automatically flow to Sugar CRM. Let's create a quotation in Sugar CRM and push it to SAP to get a feel of the solution. So here I create a quotation. And I select the customer. As it is the same customer for bill to and ship to, I leave it as blank. At this point of time, I don't have a customer PO. I select the document type. I select, let's say, the sales stage and the order reason. I give that I will have an outcome of this opportunity by end of January. The requested delivery date is by end of Feb. The quotation is valid from end of January till uh, end of December till end of January rather. So I save this header. Once I've done this, I can create as many line items as I wish. So let's order this particular material and have three quantities in the line item. Once I have added all the line items, I can push this document into SAP. Once uh, this call is successful, it's a bi-directional call. Uh, SAP returns the quotation number, the document price and the tax amount. Let's see this quotation in SAP. So you can see that the valid dates valid from valid till the prices and all the details have been pushed from sugar crm to sap now as i was telling you earlier the entire document flow is visible in sugar crm so let me open up an order which has completed its life cycle so when i open this particular order I can see that there is a delivery document associated with it which has this tracking number and this delivery date and this goods issue date. Also there is an invoice which has this particular amount and the payment due date is this particular date. Now this is on the sales and distribution cycle you have the visibility of end to end cycle in CRM. There's another section to the solution which is on the account receivables. You can have different users uh, who are authorized for this section. The idea of this particular section is that uh, you can get customer statement within a date range to see what kind of payments have come in. So sometimes salespeople are also required to chase AR and that is the intention of this particular section. So here you get the customer statement you also get the open items at this point of time. So once you see, once you run this particular uh, report, you get a PDF where all the open items at this point of time for this customer is presented to you. So that's pretty much uh, the demo that I wanted to show to you. Uh, if you have any questions or any comments, you are most welcome to drop us a mail at sapsugar at beyondconsulting.com. You can also visit our website beyondconsulting.com, sapsugarconnector. Thanks a lot for watching this demo. Appreciate.